Hi there, my name is Julie Faith Ann Balzer, and I'm going to show you how quick and easy it is to change your blade. So I'm about to change my blade and notice that my machine is off. So I'm going to go ahead and open the dust cover, lift the latch here on the blade holder, pull it on out. I'm simply going to unscrew my blade, the top of the blade holder right there. And you can see the blade is there. Now, previously what I used to do is grab a hold of the blade, but actually there is a way to really make sure that you're never going to cut yourself. And I want to show you what that is, which is this is my spatula tool, which comes here with your machine. And the back of the spatula has this little bit of foam. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm just going to push the blade right into that foam, put my finger to hold it down. And as I lift this away, can you see that the blade stays in there and my finger has come nowhere near it. So that's super easy, right? Um, then what I'm going to do is I have my new blade right here. I'm just going to pull it out of the tube. It just has these little, uh, I don't know what they are, little foam ear pieces or something. Now this blade is covered. It has a little plastic cover, so I'm not worried at all about hurting myself or cutting myself. So I can just go ahead, in fact, and grab on to that little plastic piece and then just drop the blade straight in like this. You can see it's right there. And then I can just push it, tap it in, okay? Now once it's secured in there, I'm going to carefully grab the tip of this little plastic cover without pulling the blade out. You may need to put your hand down there like this just to hold the bottom part of it. There you go, pull that little bit off. Can you see how I did that just like that? Okay, the blade is in there, it drops in. I am now ready to screw this back together. Um, and in terms of safely disposing of the old blade, and there's the blade coming out right there, one of the things that to think about is if you don't throw away the tube, the cover, any of that stuff, you can in fact just take this little tube, remove the blade, again, not holding anything but the back end of it, drop it in there, you know, dispose of a little cover in there, everything, cap this together, put this in your trash, and then the trash man's not going to get cut, you're not going to get cut, it's not going to pierce anything, and that is safely disposed of, and all that is left, place it back into the blade carriage, snap this closed, close up my dust cover, and my machine is ready to use with a nice clean blade. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you'll visit my blog at balldesigns.typepad.com for lots more tips, tricks, tutorials, and of course, don't forget to visit the Scan and Cut website at scanandcut.com.